Hello there, Peter here from MyTech Today I'm going to walk you through how to get your Hotmail Live Outlook.com email working on Android. Uh, it doesn't matter which one you have, these steps are the same. It also doesn't matter what Android version you have. Once we get into the Outlook Mail application, it's all the same. So the first thing we're going to do is open the Mail application. One thing we're going to enter our email address. Again, it doesn't matter if it's a live outlook.com or hotmail account. And then we click the manual setup button. We select POP3 as the account type. Uh, then we have to set our incoming server settings. So the main thing to change here will be the POP3 server to pop3.live.com. Again, it doesn't matter what, if it's an Outlook or a Hotmail, change it to live.com, pop3.live.com. And change the security type to SSL slash TLS, except for certificates. The port will change to 995, that's okay, click next. Uh, we'll then go check our settings. Uh, in our case, we put the wrong password in, so I'll just fix that up. Then take us to our outgoing server. Main thing to check is that SMTP server is smtp.live.com. Change our security type. It's time to start start TLS, except for certificates. The make sure require sign in is tick and username and password are the same as your Outlook on our live account. This will then go again and check your settings and prompt you if there's any problems. The next account is to change how frequently it updates. The more frequently it checks, the quicker you get email when someone sends it to you, but it uses more battery life at the same time. Click next. Then we need to give it a name. The name isn't really important unless you've got multiple accounts to distinguish between them, but your display name is going to be what's shown when someone receives your email. Uh, so generally you want to set that to your full name. It's now going to sync your email. Depending on how many emails you have, this may take a while. Uh, once it's done, it's going to open up our inbox. So from here, we can click an email to open it up and view it. We can go back and look at more emails. Um, and click the mail icon with a plus next to it to create a new email. And then you can select any emails and delete them by clicking the crash can icon. You want to set up an additional account, you can go to settings and then there's an add account in the top right hand corner. Now the last thing you're probably going to want to do is create a shortcut on your home screen. So if you go back to all your applications, you find the email and you tap and hold there. It will then take you to the home page where you can drop it. So you can now open your mail from the home screen. Thank you for watching.
Portuguese tutorial for Mothar walkthrough, go to mytechtrading.com.au forward slash how to.